A girl walks into the room where her stepmother is sleeping, takes out her cell phone and calls her father, and says, Hi, Dad, are you listening to me, Dad? Stepmom wakes up angry and says, What are you doing here, girl? The girl replies, I'm sorry, Mom. I've told you a thousand times that I'm not your mother, do you understand? I'm nothing to you, and you don't have to stay in an adult room, okay? Come here, come close to me, I don't think you're sculpting me very well, you don't have to go into an adult room, you know? This is my room, your room is back there. The woman's lover enters the room and asks, what's going on here? What do you think you're doing with it? Is she bothering you again? Stepmom says, calm down. She's here, she shouldn't be here. The girl leaves the room and leaves her cell phone on the table with her father listening to everything. The lover says, grafted girl. Stepmom says, I can't take this girl anymore, my god. The lover says, yes, it doesn't stay that way. Stepmom says, I can't wait. The lover says, just me to make you relax. Stepmom says, only you. The lover says, relax a little, yes. Stepmom says, let's go. The girl comes back to pay for the cell phone and asks her father, Daddy, Daddy, did you hear everything? The father replies, Hi daughter, the father heard everything here. Look, do the following, pretend nothing happened, don't say anything. The father is going home and when the father arrives he pretends that nothing happened, okay? It's alright, I'm already going there, okay? The girl replies, okay dad, bye. The father replies, bye. Stepmom is in the kitchen with her lover when her husband arrives and says, calm down. My husband. Go to the bathroom. Baby, that's it. I'm going. Husband says, hi my love. She opens the door and says, hi love. The little girl comes running screaming, daddy. The father says, hi, my little angel. Okay? The woman asks, you're early, aren't you? The father to daughter, did you behave? Um. The woman says, she didn't behave much, no, she's very badly raised, okay? She stayed there in my room waking me up all the time, calling me mommy, mummy. She's very naughty, doing a lot of stupid things around the house. The father says, Nicole, Nicole my daughter, I told you to respect Larissa, she is practically your mother. Do you know that? The woman says, yes, yes. The father says, well, do this, my love, go to your room, think about what you did, okay? The father continues, wow, you guessed I'm hungry, right? You've already prepared a snack for me. The woman says, yes love, exactly. I know you like a simple cup of coffee, so I already left it for when you arrived, I just didn't know it would be so soon. But I was already here prepared. The husband says, I'm going to tiara this one, I'm going to wear this outfit first I'm very hot, I'm going to go to the bathroom to change this shirt and be more comfortable. The woman says, but why do you go to the bathroom to take off this shirt, you don't have to, you look so beautiful with this shirt, you know, you look so beautiful with this shirt. The husband says, you know I like to be more comfortable when I'm at home, it's time to get there, I want to take off those clothes I got from the street. The woman says, I think you should stay with me for a while, I miss you. The husband says, baby, wait a minute, that weird smell in the bathroom. This leak is. The woman says, I had diarrhea today. I'm not very well today. The husband says, I'm going to do the following then, I'm going to leave this bathroom well locked, closed so that neither Nicole, nor you nor I forget and don't enter this bathroom, we're going to use the other bathroom for now, okay? Imagine our daughter walking into that bathroom. The woman says, I'm sorry I had a little bad time. The husband says, right. When they were asleep, the woman took the key from her husband's pocket to free her lover, who was trapped in the bathroom. The lover says, why did you put me in here? The woman replies, calm down, calm down. As they were coming to the door, the girl came in front of her and said, I won't let you out. The man says, let uncle pass. Let uncle pass. The woman says, excuse me, let me talk to her. Get out of the way girl, you don't have to be here. The girl says, I'm not leaving. The woman says, yes, it will come out. 
Am I going to have to pull you over? No, right? Get out of the way, girl. The girl says, no. The mind says, look here rude girl, let me pass. The father arrives, you don't talk to my daughter like that. Get out of this house now, and go before I mess up, Will. The mind says, you give me back my underwear later. The husband continues, you bring home into my house, with my daughter in here. The woman, honey, that's not what you're thinking. Husband, love? Wash your mouth to talk about love Larissa. The woman, he's gay. Seriously. Husband, I'm working, doing everything to support this house, even sustaining certain luxuries of his. For that Larissa? The woman, what do you know, I really cheated on you, do you know why? Why do you stay in this job 72 hours there and forget about me, forget that I have my needs? I need a man here by my side, and yet you leave me here taking care of your daughter, why am I going to take care of this child, she is not even mine. Husband, I was working Larissa. Working. The woman, working, but. The husband, you promised to take care of her as if she were your own. Now get out of this house, I don't want to hear anything else, goes away. The woman insists, look, I'm sorry, we can start over. Husband, get out, will. The woman, okay. The father looks at his daughter and says, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry your father left you in this woman's hands. I promise that from today on the father will work less and spend more time with you, I just want your happiness and no one will take that away from me, I love you. I am sorry. The girl, I love you dad. Dad, I'm sorry dad.